Okay. Hello, everyone. Finally, the NATA 2022 dates have also been declared. One of the last exams, interestingly, to be declared. I think yesterday itself, we were doing a comparison video based on JE Paper 2 and NATA. NATA is one of the most important exams if you want to do VR in India. Also, relatively one of the easiest exam, I would say, as discussed yesterday. So please note the dates for the same has already been declared. Further details we are awaiting. Before I move on to sharing the details, let me just have a sound check with my host. Host, am I audible? Yes, are you audible? Thank you. So NATA 2022 dates finally has been declared. The last exam to have been declared. I think in the first week of March, we had the JE paper two dates that were declared. So these are the two most important exams that you should write. I would request every architecture aspirant to write both the exams, both JE paper two and NATA. Let's look at the details that we have got as of now. There are three dates that they have mentioned. Interestingly, last year also there were three dates. This year also they've come up with three dates. 12th June is the first NATA that will be conducted. The second NATA would be on the 3rd of July and the third one would be on the 24th of July. This is not like JE paper 2. They've given ample amount of time for everyone to prepare. I am assuming this is considering the board exams and the pandemic situation and all. Okay. So any, any questions for everyone who is watching, please do not hesitate to ask us in the live chat box. Okay. So these are the three dates that has been declared. This is the information that we have till now. We need to go further into the details. Uh, we need to wait till the official notification and other details comes up in the COA's website or NATA's website. Okay. Please note they very clearly mentioned that except for CFTIs, you, if you need admission in any other colleges, you will have to write NATA. So other than, let's say, NITs, SPAs, and all, if you want to get in, you will have to write NATA. They have very clearly mentioned. Last year, there was a confusion. This time, they have made it very clear. Except for CFTAs, you need to write NATA. It's mandatory. So please do not lose this opportunity. Please start preparing as soon as possible. And once the registration forms are out, please do fill it. We have our new batches for NATA, exclusive for, uh, <coughs> sorry, NATA crash batches that are coming up from the 14th, that is from tomorrow. Okay, so we have uh, uh, our one-to-one uh, -one sessions and subject-wise mock test and all, which will help you a lot in uh, reaching the heights that you want to. That is relatively, as I said, one of the easiest exams that everyone can crack. So it's it's to an extent predictable, it's to an extent relatively easy. There are lots of seeds also that you get in, in Nanda compared to J paper two. Okay. So anyone and everyone who wants to join can contact us from the number that's provided 8086 116 Please note we had also done a session comparing JE paper two and NATA. So just to give you an idea of what those two exams are, personally, I would suggest everyone, every architecture aspirant to write both of those papers. To get an idea about that, I am resharing that the video is available in our channel, JE Paper 2 versus NATA. So the, the objective of doing this particular video was to give you a very clear picture on what are those two exams, where you can get into once you do those exams. Okay, The more the information that you have, the easier your decision making will be. So any, uh, any other questions, any other queries, doubts and all, please do ask me in the chat box, in the live chat box here. Or if you want to ask later on, uh, after seeing the recorded session of this particular live also, you can ask. Okay. Um, Salhan Fatima asks, can I attend three NATA exams? See, last year they had three NATA and uh, what they did was they permitted everyone to write two of them, any two of them. So basically... Uh, it, it might be that way. We will have to wait for the official information bulletin to come up. Okay. Now, NATA is an exam with which you can apply to a lot of private colleges, a lot of government colleges in corresponding states. Every state has its own admission procedure. So NATA as such doesn't have a counseling procedure. You get the NATA score and most probably with your 12th standard score, you can combine both of that together and start applying for the other uh, colleges. Okay. Kerala has scheme, Maharashtra has DD, uh, Tamil Nadu has TNEA, Karnataka has uh, Comet K, and also one that's corresponding to their own states. Okay, so every state has its own different uh, bodies that would be taking care of all these things. So huge, huge number of colleges are there. 
under NATA. So if you write NATA, it's opening up a large, wide horizon. What usually happens is students, uh, any updates about drawing or the syllabus? No, we have to wait. We have to wait. For the last two years, they haven't conducted physical drawing. NATA hasn't conducted physical drawing. We are waiting for how exactly the information bulletin brochure uh, would talk about the, these things. So we have to wait. Last two years, they hadn't conducted. Before that, they did have. JE, however, on the other hand, has been conducting it consistently. Okay. So, very important point to note. Uh, last year, I think there were a lot of students who didn't apply for NATA. They solely focused on JE paper. So, even if you're focusing solely on JE paper, I would suggest please do, suggest, uh, please do write uh, NATA also. Please do write and uh, apply for NATA. Okay. So, our new batches will be starting from the 14th. You can either contact us at 8086 216 or you can dm us at instagram you can find us at think institute by instagram you can find us at think institute okay so that would be it from our side until we see in the next session thank you everyone thank you host